With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, today's question is prove that 1 x x cube 1 y y cube 1 z z cube is equal to x minus y y minus z z minus x into x plus y plus z. Okay, so we are given this determinant 1 x x cube 1 y y cube 1 z z cube. Okay, now we are going to apply some operations. We are going to tend row 2 tends to row 2 minus row 1 and row 3 tends to row 3 minus row 1 so this will become as row 1 will be written as it is so 1 x x cube now row 2 tends to row 2 minus row 1 so 1 minus 1 0 y minus x and y cube minus x cube now row 3 tends to row 3 minus row 1 1 minus 1 0 z minus x and z cube minus x cube so z cube minus x cube okay now we know in formula since a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b whole cube plus 3ab into a minus b so this can be written as when I take a minus b common so a minus b and here we are having a minus b whole square plus 3ab right so in our case what is a a is y and b is x okay so putting here the values so that will become y cube minus x cube will be equal to here a is y so y b is x so y minus x and here this is y minus x square plus 3 x y okay now look at the determinant here so in the determinant we are having this as 1 0 0 this is x this is y minus x and this is z minus x this is x cube now y cube minus x cube is what it is this so this will be y minus x into y minus x whole square plus 3 x y got it now see here we are having a z cube minus x cube similarly this is y minus x so z minus x will be similar to this replace a by z and b by x so this will become z minus x okay and multiply with z minus x whole square plus 3 z x got it now see we're going to take out common we're going to take out this y minus x and z minus x common so y minus x will take out common from row 2 and z minus x from row 3 so the determinant will become 1 0 0 x 1 1 x cube y minus x square plus 3 x y then here z minus x square plus 3 x z okay now we will expand this along column number 1 so when expanding this we are getting y minus x into z minus x we were having here this will become 1 into z minus x square plus 3 x z minus y minus x square minus 3 x y okay so that is y minus x into z minus x now here this will open with a minus b whole square okay what is a minus b whole square a minus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2 ab okay so you open this using that properties that is z square z square 
plus x square then minus 2xz then here we are having plus 3xz then here minus sign then y minus x whole square that is also similar to a minus b whole square so open this using this bracket so using this identity we are getting here y square plus x square then this is minus 2xy and then minus 3xy okay so this will become as see this will be we are going to multiply this minus inside this bracket so we are having here y minus x into z minus x then here we are having x square plus z square then minus this is y square okay so see minus y square and then here we are having plus xz see minus 2xz plus 3xz will give us only one xz then minus y square then minus x square plus 2y and minus 3y so this is plus 2xy 2xy and minus 3xy okay now on simplification this will become this is y minus x into z minus x and this is see minus x square and plus x square will get cancelled so here we are having z square minus y square then plus here from this is what x z and here we are having 2xy minus uh, 3xy so that is minus xy so from xz and xy we can take out x common so we are left with only z minus y true right so now this will be y minus x into z minus x and here we are having this is similar to a square minus b square identity okay so let me write it here so a square minus b square is what it is a plus b into a minus b using this identity this thing will be written as z plus y into z minus y then plus here we are having x into z minus y okay now see this is y minus x z minus x now we will take out a z minus y common so z minus y and then what we will left here z plus y plus x okay now see from these two terms we will take out minus common so minus minus this will become plus so this is x minus y then here y minus z and then z minus x okay and that is x plus y plus z this is what this thing is equal to the right hand side which is the rhs okay now see we started with this thing determinant and its value is only coming equal to the right hand side so we can say the determinant was the left hand side okay so we started solving this determinant this left hand side and that is coming equal to this right hand side so therefore we can say that lhs is coming equal to rhs so hence proved okay so this is the required answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today